<laughs> the good ship NTG. McLaughlin said, if you tried to talk about this game exclusively during the Shadow Quest, it would inevitably devolve into shipping. Here's the case. I don't... Naomi, you, know, you, really, you played Chrono Trigger, but you haven't really played a game like Chrono Trigger with like a lot of grinding and random battles. You haven't really played that before, have you? I guess Enchanted Arms. But anything else? Wait, isn't there just anything one else, Naomi? platform planet per system? Naomi. Um, I'm thinking. Naomi! I'm thinking! Okay, Dave, you obviously have. <laughs> yeah. You played you played through Final Fantasy, like many of them. You yeah, played I love through. You played through Chrono Trigger, you played through. Did you beat Secret of Mana? Like. No. No? Uh, I set two. I play, I, I yeah. beat uh, second and second. So, so fucking awesome. when you were a kid and you were playing through these these grindy RPGs, did you ever, like, as you were grinding out the levels, did you ever imagine, like, the characters talking to each other? Oh, there's a hidden thing. You missed it. You went over it. It's in the It's in the, belt. the ring of See asteroids. I yeah, know. Yeah. Must be where I'm going. Then. Probably. Probably. Uh, yep. The carbon asteroid. Sorry. Or maybe it's not. Um, what the shit? Well, something. There has to be a plant somewhere. No, no. I, I kind of thought the, about them. On the very outskirts, because there's like a ring on the like go down, go down to the very bottom. Have you gone there? Yeah. I mean, there's so many things in stories that we we just kind of we choose to ignore, or they because they're never touched. Like you know, I mean, can you imagine uh, a fucking fairy fantasy princess going for a shit? <laughs> okay, fine, maybe in a sexual way, but. You know, Edge there's. Bar? Is that it? Yep. Okay. Yep. Yeah. But there, there is a lot of stuff that doesn't get touched on much at all, which is why I think stuff like, um, like, like Song of Ice and Fire is really good because it does. It does get, like get, give every little side story. Mm hmm Yeah. It details everything because it's it's supposed to be. It's an alternate history, and it's a way of getting in the headspace of of people historically speaking. I mean, he yeah. he he treats it less like a fantasy book and more like a political intrigue. Yeah. Which is why it grabbed people to begin with. That's yeah, why there yeah, are people exactly. like, you know, like fucking bored housewives and shit like that, that that got into it because it's as much about the, the you know the character dynamics as it yeah. is about about you know this overarching Holy fuck, we're in a dynamic. snowstorm here. Oh. Dude, wasn't a sandstorm. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> um, no, Dave, I, I guess I guess what, what I kind of want to I want to bring up then is like my first my first uh bailey jay's uh is a porn actress that, that got her start on 4chan and she was really really hot like okay when she was underage i think i was underage and she was really cute back then and then she actually got into real porn she's just kind of fat now she's not she's not that fine anymore if you've seen her in the past year she just kind of looks, looks like, looks like a, a fat dude Oh, look. Oh, oh God. It's a Thresher Maw. Oh. Wait, isn't, I thought the Thresher Maws were on the other planet. The Thresher Maws are on the, are, all the planets. They're, they're on a few planets, dude. What? Oh, fuck. Get out. He, repair, repair. Oh. You're like on fire, dude. You're dead. Oh, you're dead. Yeah. Never mind. You just got fucked by that Thresher If you mod. see a Thresher Maw, get the fuck out. Just don't even go. You know what? If you're, if you're near she there, She went SJW? Don't. Yeah, probably. Oh, fu fuck SJW. Okay. Anyway. Mm. Um. Guys, when I was playing Final Fantasy VI through as a kid, so it was Final Fantasy III when we were kids, you know. Um, if you guys know that game, there's the part where you split off into three teams in the World of Balance. It's definitely one of my favorite parts. Yeah, we, you have to choose between, uh, it's Locke, Sabin, and Celis. And Celis, right. And the Sabin part, you end up going to the Velt, and you find... Oh, and yeah, that's right, you, you, meet, uh, you, get, you get... You meet Shadow, you meet Gayu. Or Gao or whatever. I think it's Gao. Gao, and you meet uh, Cyan. Yeah. And I think when you first arrive on, on the Velt, you have with you Cyan already. Yeah. And you have a uh, Shadow with you, I think, at least for a little while. Mm -hmm. um, and then you can go get get Gao if you want. Um, but I was grinding in some area just before the Velt. It was like a small little pit patch of land outside of a town, and I was just grinding it up. And it was three characters. I, th I think it was Sabin, Cyan, and Shadow. I think it was those I, I, three. I'm pretty sure it is. I'm pretty sure it was those three. Um, and I was just grinding for like an hour, just kind of getting levels up and getting stuff, getting stuff done. And, oh, um, Shadow leaves before the Velt. Okay. He, he leaves before the Velt? Okay, yeah. So it was before the Velt then. Um, and I was just imagining... Oh, yeah, like there's the painter girl. It, at, at, at this point in the game, you, you kind of know all three characters. Like You know that Shadow's the loner. Yeah, good job. Good job. You know that Shadow's the loner, but he still kind of has a heart of gold. You know that um, 
Cyan is like the, the blood knight, and you know that Sabin's like the strong dumb guy, right? So I'm just imagining these three characters having these, these conversations while I'm grinding, and then they're like just stupid fucking conversations. Mm -hmm. And that was kind of the first Boring instance. Boring conversation anyway. <laughs> that was kind of the, Sabin and Sand hit the veld after diving off the waterfall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was kind of the conversation, was there, that was kind of the first time I realized that like, characters can potentially be more than what the author writes them as depending on what medium you're consuming the media in. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Does Lolly count as real SCP? <laughs> um, yeah, it's kind of pushing it. It's still pretty distasteful. If you, if you like, okay, if you fucking post, like, drawn-ass toddlers getting fucked, I'm probably going to boot you off. Baby fuck, baby fuck, baby fuck. Because I don't feel like getting arrested. Yeah. Let's go around. Just switch the lag to let it through. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. Some people think story only exists in your head because they've been like, shaming for it. Well, here's the thing, Torvar, because I later found out. That, I mean, of course, it's obviously a, an idea that everyone shares at least at some point. Oh, there you Fuck, go. Fuck, dude. What's that? It's a get. Fortification, I guess. What are they fighting in the middle? They're doing something down there. Yeah, they're, oh, they're firing at you. Oh, I thought like there were like it was like an arena or something. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Two geth enter, one geth leaves. Here's the thing, like, there are so many hentes out there of like high schoolers banging. I don't give a shit. And, the, and like, there's so many hentes out there where like the girl looks like she's about twelve, but is actually three thousand years old. Fine, but like, if we're talking Stand actual still. fucking like. Undeveloped child, baby, no, you fucking asshole. I don't know you say that to a, a lot of a lot of get down there. Um. Anyway, no. Here's the thing, guys. I later realized that this is something that everyone does because um, once I picked up a copy of the Secret of Mana Player's Guide, mm -hmm. um, they actually said outright that like. Every entry in the guide, and this is true because I've read the guide, every entry somebody. in the guide is written by the, char the three characters. Hmm. And they talk like they're having these side missions that aren't actually in the game, but they're completely in character. And it makes sense for the context of the game. So it's like the, 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 mission, the, the guide actually adds to the game in that sense, you know? Yeah, and, it's, and it, it's, it's lore building, which is pretty awesome. It's kind of the same thing with uh, World of Ice and Fire, and they have the... Um, I do agree that drawn child porn harms nobody, but I don't like getting fucking arrested. Yep. Um, the, the, the maester that wrote the book, they did that so... They, they did it so uh, George R. R. Martin could manipulate things as he needed because it's, he's, an un, he's an unreliable narrator. Yeah, they can just be like, oh, this guy was just wrong. He just made yeah. shit up. Because, you know, he kind of sucks Lannister dick, stuff like that, because it's pretty evident at the time that Lannisters are... In power. They're in at, power. At that point of it, yeah. Natalie Mars, like I don't, I don't really like her. She's she's kind of cute. Who? It's just a, a tranny porn star. Oh. Like she's kind of cute, um, but like she's not that cute. She's okay, and she's um, like her, her political opinions like aren't the fucking heart of gold that everyone thinks that they are. Weak. Yeah, I think you gotta get in there, man. Yeah, you gotta go in and just bang her in. You guys are just talking about fucking tranny porn stars this whole goddamn time. What are you doing? What are you doing? Trying to repair. Apparently not. You already fully repaired. What? No, no, you, it's it's your shields. And you just need to recharge. That's all. Yeah, they, they come back by like themselves. It's only slowly. when you get your, your yeah. actual um, Armor. chassis gets yeah. damaged that you can use the repair. So, Romad, you just support people because they're right wing. That's that's very collectivist of you. Why would you want to support someone that's right wing, anyways? Well, he, mine, You're a fucking immigrant. <laughs> well, honestly, because the left is ridiculous right now, dude, not the right. I never what thought I'd live to see the fucking dude, day, but here we the, are. What about the center? Uh, the centers are... Dude. <laughs> how, how does the quote go, man? It's like, what drives a man to be neutral? <laughs> <laughs> For Futurama? <laughs> Yeah, just keep shooting. Keep in mind, you can also use your rockets into void. 
I think she's been using them, yeah. See? Boom! No, no, you're driving back. You could just use your rockets and bounce. <laughs> Under oh, dude, you're almost dead. Fuck. He, he, R repair, repair, repair. Hide and repair. Press that Y. Now your tires are coming back. Just gotta reflate those tires. Don't worry about it. Oculus repair. Clowns are the last me jokers, right? Yeah, you know what? That's never been more relevant. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh, the Geth Colossus shields came back. Yeah. Fucking women drivers. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Okay, so you're not actually... Okay. Well, no, that's, that's, that's the job. radical left, though. I mean, uh, that's the difference, right? I'm, st I'm still going to just choose Blair White as best trans. She's oh, still kind of stupid, but she's really hot. The Lord is talking politics. Death is talking about fucking dicks. <laughs> Dude, they're talking about dicks. What the... That was is there more? Yeah. Can you, can you kill she the ship? Sh can you kill the ship? Nah. There's no there's no health bar for the ship. Just fucking shoot him, dude. Radical left and tubular right. <laughs> I prefer gnarly. And what a... Yes, yes, you have to join the mainstream right wing in order to get back at those nasty SAWs. That's if I could drive, this would be a lot easier. Holy you're gonna, you're, you're fuck gonna fucking die. You're, you're gonna, gonna get, hide, get hide. Get out, get out, get out. And use another, use another heel. Use another heel, use another heel. Press that Y. Well, stop. <laughs> you wanna play? Go right ahead. Nope, no, I'm gonna let you do this. Then shut up. <laughs> fuck sakes. Uh. In my very fucking soul. Not in mine. Just, just let the shield come back to you. You gotta wait like 20 minutes. Like, look, look how slow it takes them to recharge. It's because you need to upgrade. There's, there's gotta be an upgrade to the fucking everything. Why would you want to upgrade the Mako? It's a piece of shit. What are you doing? <laughs> at this point, I think I, I think I have to agree with that with Naomi. You might as well just get back in there and finish the fight. Finish the fight. Just fire rockets into him. Yeah, there you go. Oh, Geth Primes, dude. Yeah, there we go. Uh-oh. Charge! Charging. They're still, they're still alive, kind of. You gotta shoot them some more. Two outposts done. We're halfway oh, there. Oh, no. Wait, really? <laughs> Wait, so, okay, so you, that you can... Two outposts now? here? No, or I'm just in general? I think it means, like, like the two, oh, you gotta go two another system planets. Then. Okay, well... Is there anything else on this plant while we're here? There's a question mark over there. Nah, I can't get to it. That's where Dude, the... Dude, it's anti-bar. You just boost through, man. No, that's where the thingy is. It Go, was go like... as fast as you can. No, it came up right where the fucking question marks were. There's two of them over there. Yeah, I think it'll be okay. <sighs> I, I, I remember killing pressure malls in this game with, with the Mako. It's possible, isn't it? It is, which is it's very dangerous. Because it can kill you instantly. What the fuck is Riley Dennis? I don't even know, man. I don't know. Are they related to Rocky Dennis? Probably someone from, dumb. You know Rocky Dennis? Who's Rocky Dennis? <laughs> he's the guy from the, um, the character from the fucking movie Mask, where he's got like this. Uh, it's like he's got lionitis, the same thing that the, the Elephant Man had. Yeah. So it's like Jesus. Giant cranial, you know, like, protrusions and stuff like that. So. Yeah. Yeah. He's like the joke on Family Guy where. Um, because he, I guess there's like a blind girl that he ends up with, and she like she she, she feels his face. She's like, oh my god, it feels like a fucking cliff. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch, dude. Yeah, it's pretty brutal. No, she's just oh, she transient. Bad. Okay, she's a transient. Really? There's probably a joke in there somewhere. Transient, trans. Who's having a fucking house party out there? Probably. I wanted to launch a rocket at a neighbor. She, her well, car was in there last time I checked. Have you noticed that, like, in the past couple of years, this area has changed to really con be con to, like consist of like mid twenties couples? Yeah. It looks like our next door neighbor over there. People who bought that house. Yeah. They're like a mid twenties couple now. They're, they're like, you know, got got my first real job kind of thing. Moved to the city. No, just like Kate. Okay, 
the people who lived downstairs long, 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 like long before me, the um, the couple yeah. were like, he just got a job somewhere else and she just moved to be with him and then she just got like a shitty job and had a kid kind of thing. Tiff? Yeah. They didn't have, they didn't have a kid. They have kids now. Oh, now, but. Yeah, that's what I mean though. Like, it's always a situation where like the guy will move for his career. The girl's like, well, okay. And then like becomes a hairdresser or something stupid. And then they <laughs> she start was having, a hairdresser. Exactly. And then they start having kids, right? Well, you know what? Our neighbor over there who got, who got the house there, it, it, that's what, I'll oh, just load that oh, face Oh, now you can do <laughs> the Unity thing, that's right. Unity. But no, the neighbor over there, that's what happened with them. Like, there was like, a muscular tattooed guy who owned that house and he like built the back deck that we can see yeah, from our he window. Was, he was from, uh, actually, I think he was from the same place that Colink is from. Yeah, and, he, and he, he built the back deck, he built the shed back there. And yeah. then like, he sold the house off to that new couple and they're like, oh, well, we're just coming to town because, you know, uh, my boyfriend got a job and it's really, you know, he's, he's, he's gonna make us a lot of money and I'm just gonna, you know, maybe work part time and then start kind of, you know, setting up house. It's like, oh, fuck. Yeah, and, and she, and the then new, she come, the what the dream. fuck's happening here? Something uh, is a meteor meteors. storm. Summon the meteors. <laughs> <laughs> but then she's like, oh yeah, guys, can you come over and help me shove my driveway time to time? And I'm like, no. Fuck off. <laughs> Do your own goddamn driveway. Yep. Now, just shit oh, like that. Oh, okay. So on the topic of couples, yeah. I saw, uh, well, let's say an acquaintance. Check your armaments. What's going on? Do we get, do we get armaments? I don't know what armaments are. So I saw They're weapons. Weapons, dude. Oh, yeah, I'll do that one day. So I'm an old acquaintance from high school, and uh, I, just, I, I, I thought she was, like, with her with her dad and, like, her brother or something, mm -hmm. and I didn't really notice what was in the cart because I wasn't paying that much attention because we, we were chatting it up. And uh, I was just like, so, yeah, what have you been up to? She's like, oh, well, I've been busy points to the cart. I finally noticed the, the car seat in the cart. I'm like, oh, okay. So I have to assume the guy she was with who looked like he was, like, really old was like her boyfriend or something and I'm like hmm, okay I'm not gonna make a comment I'll be like oh I, I said something like along the lines of oh hey neat well, <laughs> well keep in mind there, there's a 10 year gap between us though yes I know but like he looked really old like much older than 10 year gap yeah oh Jesus I'm hoping it was her dad but all the off chance that it wasn't you <laughs> <laughs> come over and plow my driveway you go over there a uh, driveway tramp stamp no, I, I mean, here's the thing. Our, our, I feel like our, our relationship is a bit different because one, you're pretty mature, I'm pretty immature. Um, I still look relatively young. Now nah, you're going great. You're oh, gonna yeah, be like yeah, salt yeah, and yeah. pepper. Fucking, yeah, sure. <laughs> um, but also yeah. because, um, yeah, you have flat note. But also because um, like we're, we're at similar stages of our lives and neither of us want kids. So that kind of takes a lot of things out of the, the equation, right? No, kids the best kids that anyone could have. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Like I, I still, I still, as a rule, do not approve, or do not, 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 not approve, do not think that like large, large year gap relationships will ever work out. Just that you and I are like a very obvious exception, you know. There's like some exceptions to the rule sometimes. Don't Most fucking of the go time off, you. Doesn't work. What the <laughs> fuck? Naomi, can you talk and drive at the same time? Do you mind I'm not, not getting any evidence? What the fuck? <laughs> Turn. Turn the car. But I'm going that way. <laughs> Dev, you Which only way look. Am I going? That's oh not God, the fucking way. way. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Dev, you only look young in the sense that you have the proportions of a baby. <laughs> 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 like a giant head. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Sick burn. <laughs> Do not drive the Mato Mako into the vortex. Oh, McLaughlin. Did you watch through our Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening Let's Play? Because that's an old good one. That's like a... That, that's a stage two SFO Let's Play. That was actually pretty good too. Link's Awakening was good. I've seen being Link's Awakening good. and Link to oh, the Past were both stage two right, good because good that's really into the, into the Vortex. That's what it brought yeah, up, didn't it? It came from... Into the Vortex. That was like three years ago, man. Yeah. Yeah, because... <sighs> Dave, you, should, you, should, you shouldn't extend yourself or like... No, 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 Dave, you were, you, you were walking around like whirlpools up in the mountains of Link's Awakening, right? Yeah. And I was like, Dave, Dave, you're extending yourself too thin about something. And then you're like, Dev, just extend yourself into this vortex. <laughs> into the vortex. <laughs> into the vortex, yeah. That was a good one. 
But it's, again, it's three years old. Who the fuck's gonna go back and watch that shit now, man? It was really good, but like, the the quality of, of video is just not there. You know what I mean? Like here, show of hands in the chat room, guys. How many of you, if you had the time and like we took like a week or two off, how many of you guys would actually go back and watch the old really good Let's Plays? Cover me. Huh. The Malin's Bloomers quote you ended most of the videos with is unforgettable. Malin's Bloomers, Indeed. I don't remember this. I'll follow. Why is the crash probe over there when it's actually uh, there? No. I kind of recall something about her bloomers, but yeah. Yeah, and honestly, like the first, I'd say the first third of the Wild Arms that's play was actually really good too. We had some good times in that. Yeah, and I know that you couldn't do it, Frozen Binary. You, you're doing your game, Dev. Yep, yep. Fairies watch them all. Kiri Nico might. Cool. For me, Dev, it'll be really. Yeah, exactly. Like some of you guys don't have time for that shit, right? Like if we took a week off, I'm sure some of you would have time to go back and watch it, and some of you wouldn't want to because. Like, some of you, I, I assume, you'd want to watch it live because that, that, that's part of the fun, is watching well, it live. It's the engagement, yeah. Yeah. You know, I am curious, though. Like, how many of you would actually do it? Go back and see the old ones. None, because none of you are true viewers like fairies. <laughs> <laughs> fairies, the only true. Oh, fuck, yeah. I thought he said that. <laughs> like, Torvar's, Torvar has watched every video we've put out multiple times. He's fucking great. You're amazing, dude. And Torvar. I'm sorry, Torvar. <laughs> <laughs> Watches us, ignores kid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's the Geth outpost. Oh, shit, yeah. Bomb that fucker. Yeah. Uh, oh, fuck, he's taking it. Uh, oh, Romad. <laughs> You're you're young, yeah. so it's not like you you have been able to experience. I mean, at the same time, times so like I mean, you could you could say that you was, haven't experienced anything, but no, dude, on, you, you, on, yeah. didn't you move? Yeah, you moved to a new country. You, like you've experienced different kinds of culture. Yeah, back the fuck up and do, do, use a. Yeah, some might say that you've actually experienced a lot. Use a why. Yeah, but here's the thing, man. I, I, hadn't, I, I didn't really start, like, in my opinion, seriously experiencing my life in a positive way till I was, like, 25. So don't worry about it, man. If I could aim, I didn't even life really start. would be great. Oh, it, no! Dude, get out, go, get out, go, get, out, get, out get out, get out. Get Wait, hold on. Ah. Uh, so be careful, because if you fall too far, right. you're going to die. <laughs> Isn't it weird that Naomi chose to play as a female? Wouldn't that make him feel dysphoric? Who? You. Me? Yeah, you're a him, apparently. Yummy. I like reliving my glory days. <laughs> Your glory days. Now, this isn't the Geth outpost. This is an anomaly. No, I, th I think it's the Oh, outpost. it is an outpost. It's not... Okay, go to the map. The outpost, because the outpost all the way over here. Oh. This is an anomaly. Well, we'll just well, go deal okay. with this anyway. For fuck's sakes. Okay, Get well, experience. God Level damn up. it, people. I, mean, I know what I'm talking about. Oh, I... Run I, 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 I thought you meant... Yeah, you missed him though, huh? Dude. Now he's getting shot everywhere. You're just, you're just a shoot. Stick. You have like no more on you, Joe. You used it all up. I have like 75 fucking There's tons meals. of it. Life dude. begins when you can't pretend you're in your mid 20s anymore. I disagree. I still pretend I'm in my mid 20s, dude. I pretend I'm fucking 19. It's creepy. Why? <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> uh oh. Sorry. Ours in Peace is over in the YouTube chat and he yelled at us for not reading it. I just noticed it, man. Yeah, Juan Herrera, that's our, that's ours in Peace. Naomi, you know, you're just getting fucked, dude. It's not my fault! The shields just keep dying! Yep. <sighs> we're at 24 fucking minutes. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Naomi, back off a bit. Back off. And get out. <laughs> we're gonna take a break. Over the break, Naomi's shields will recharge because she'll leave it uh, unpaused. Back, back off, back off, back off, back off, back off! Jesus Christ. 